macaroons. Sounds delicious to me. But what if macaroons were made with tofu? Would you try it then? Well, we all should because they were yumbo-licious and vaulted our next guest to winning MasterChef Junior. So Alexander, what was it like winning the uh, TV show? It was pretty incredible. I mean, um, meeting the judges was great and you know, being able to learn on the show was great. Uh, it, was it was an amazing experience. Well, congratulations again. I know the pressure was on you, cameras on you, you made it to the finals. What do you think uh, set you apart from the others? Um, well, we had a three course meal um, in the end for uh, the finale for the judges. And I would say probably my veal chop dish with the uh, gnocchi and the uh, butter sage sauce was probably uh, the winning dish. Um, yeah. Well, that certainly is delicious. I know that you make macarons, your dessert with tofu. Why do you love working with tofu? I mean, I guess tofu is the next chapter because, um, you know, I've developed a lot of recipes in the past, you know, especially um, lots of desserts and pastries. Um, and I just, you know, tofu is a great way to impart more protein since it is a soybean based protein. Um, it's great for salads or grilling or, you know, replacing meat in and making a vegetarian entree. Um, and it's also great in desserts. And one of my signature desserts also made on uh, MasterChef was uh, French macaroons. And I've made some here today with a tofu filling. Um, so I've taken recipes that I've developed in the past and just adding tofu so that there's, you know, a little bit of a healthy aspect um, while, while you're eating your desserts so that you can, you know, feel a little bit better while you're eating them. And um, tofu is just a great way to impart more uh, texture since tofu comes in different textures such as soft which is great for desserts great for creaming or smoothies uh, then there's medium firm there's firm and then there's extra firm which is great for grilling um, tofu and it can be put over salads like this one here I have a spicy grilled tofu uh, just simply grilled on um, a barbecue and put over uh, my favorite greens and uh, one of my newest recipes that I've been working on is a tofu crouton and I have some here over a butternut squash soup and I can show you how I make them. Um, it's really simple, it's great to do at home. Um, it's really fast and easy and it's healthy so that you don't have to worry about the carbs um, with normal croutons, for example. Um, so this is a much, healthy, uh, much healthier uh, option rather than using the bread. So I'm adding a little, I'm adding a little bit of uh, curry powder, olive oil, um, some paprika, some cayenne, and I'll season it with a little bit of salt and pepper. And this is just like an example of what you can do with tofu. Um, and you can add any herbs or spices that you want. Tofu is very versatile um, and it's really easy to prepare. Well, certainly cool indeed. I mean, we're gonna see a lot of you. You have such talent, uh, not only for cooking, but presence on camera. Congratulations on that. But given you're only 14, what advice would you give to parents to support their kids and things they enjoy? Um, I think that it's important to um, you know, let kids express their passions, you know, no matter what it is. Um, you know, it's important to have some kind of hobby that you really like doing and um, kind of enhance it a little bit. And, um, you know, it helps in all different levels, you know. Uh, cooking is just something that I've always liked to do. Um, and since I kind of liked it from an early age, I kept going with it. And, you know, my parents supported me. They taught me how to cook. Um, and I guess that's, that's really how I got, you know, to where I am now, you know, cooking with tofu and being on MasterChef. It all started with that. Well, so cool indeed. We look forward to more yummy recipes and more uh, TV appearances with you, Alexander. But given your tremendous success, what advice would you give to all of us? Um, I think that it's important to follow your passions and, you know, don't get stuck doing what you wouldn't want to do. You know, it's important to have a passion and, um, you know, pursue that. Wow, Alexander, great words of wisdom, following your passion. We're glad you're doing it. Congratulations on your success, and thanks for joining us. Thank you.